Uh, it's the holidays and we're all super stressed. We've got a lot of things that are coming our way. And when we go into debt, we go into stress. And so today I wanna give you some tips. It might not do to fitness, but it's definitely gonna help you so that you can keep a clear mind, continue to work out at the gym, and continue to give back to you. Number one is that you need to pick a budget, work out, use your calendar, bring protein, okay? Number one is that you need to pick a budget and you need to stick to your budget. Yes, buying gifts is important, but do you need to buy that crazy, crazy gift? You know why? Because I am yet to see someone in a good place if they're having money issues. Think about the last time you're able to just be present, that you're taking care of yourself, that you're taking care of others, but yet you're having money issues. Not many people have a good time when they are broke. And usually when people are low in funds, the first thing that they give up is their gym membership. In December, that's when most people are like, I'm too busy, uh, I can't afford these gym memberships right now, I need to go and buy these other things. And so what do they do is they forget all about themselves and how they need to take care of themselves. Without no health, there is no wealth. So when it comes to spending this year, I want you to pick a budget and I want you to stick to the budget. Number two, workout. Workout is a proven anti-depression. It's like a pill that you would do, that you can do every day. And sure, you might be paying to work out with the coach or go to the gym, but you can pay for the coach and the gym, which is going to add way more value to your life. Or you can spend money on therapy, on pills, or other sedative methods that are going to help you cope with the amount of stress that you're going through. So go to the gym, work out, release those feel-good hormones. Number three is online shopping. Now we think that we have to go to the mall, we have to go to the outlets, or we have to go to this other place and check out this thing like Walmart. But then we're dealing with traffic, we're dealing with people, and there's a good chance that we're waiting in line and we're probably overpaying. Whereas a lot of things that you want to buy can be bought online, and in fact, if you search the thing up on Google, so let's say you wanna buy somebody a brand new set of headphones. Now, if you just type those headphones into Google and you click on the shopping link, it's gonna show you 10 or 15 different pricing for that. And most online companies, or most companies nowadays, prefer you to actually buy from their online store versus coming in. So if you can get all of your shopping done, that's gonna save you hours, grueling hours of jumping in line, jumping your car, dealing with traffic, and just saving money. So online shopping is gonna be your go-to when you actually have to buy these gifts. And number four is that you need to use your calendar right away. We tend to overcommit and double book, which means that we cannot enjoy the evening because we are rushing and causing more and more stress. And so if you are making plans with somebody or if you got things that you need to do, make sure that yourself and your family all have a community online calendar. Never mind writing a calendar hand and putting on the fridge. Nobody's home. People are busy. People are out dealing with other things. So get with the times, jump on Google, create a family Google calendar that as soon as something comes up, you put it into that calendar and everybody can see it and this way you're not double booking and over committing which has caused you more stress, which is causing you not to go to the gym. And last but not least, bring protein, okay? Always have a protein shake, a bar, or other protein options with you. Something super like pepperoni sticks, Pre-made chicken bites, Neri bars, and Maria waffles or the Carb Killer bars are all fantastic ways that you're gonna prevent yourself from going through the drive-through. Yes, that Tim Hortons ad looks phenomenal, but no, if you missed your workout, you cannot afford 1,200 calories coming from one of these healthy bowls. I'm telling you, those bowls, those salads, they're all very high in calories, and they do that because they gotta make salads taste good. So if you think you're actually eating healthy by eating out and picking one of their loaded salads, you're probably loading yourself with calories. So the best thing you can do is just eat at home or eat your meal prep. And if you're out and about, then always keep protein with you. Now, if you want some fun and healthy options to use this holiday season, then I put a link to Neri's YouTube channel where she's got tons of awesome high protein recipes. Go into the description, click on the link where it says Neri's Kitchen Recipes slash Meal Plans.